हेलो व्यूवर्स इन टूडे सेशन वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस अनदर इम्पॉर्टेंट प्रॉब्लम फ्रॉम डिरेक्ट डेल्टा फंक्शन सो हियर इन दिस क्लास वी विल डिस्कस दिस इंटीग्रल दैट इज जीरो टू पाई एंड हियर वी हैव थीटा एंड द एब्सोल्यूट वैल्यू ऑफ साइन थीटा एंड डेल्टा डबल प्राइम थीटा माइनस पाई बाई फोर डी थीटा so here uh, we have to evaluate this integral involving the famous uh, dirac delta function right so uh, let us call this integral as i and here we can see that uh, the uh, absolute value of uh, sin theta is involved and the second derivative of uh, delta function uh, it occurs right so uh, let us see how we can uh, solve this integral by uh, using uh, some properties of dirac delta function so here i uh, will make use of this property of uh, delta function uh, that is integral minus infinity to infinity and if we have a function say f of theta and here we have the nth derivative of uh, delta function and theta minus a d theta then the value of this uh, integral is given by minus 1 raised to n and the nth derivative of this function f of theta uh, evaluated at this point uh, that is a right so here uh, we have uh, this integral right so let us compare uh, this integral with this one so f of theta is given by uh, this function so f of theta is theta uh, multiplied with absolute value of sin theta and here uh, we have double prime so it implies that uh, the second order derivative of dirac delta function is involved so n is equal to 2 uh, and uh, here the value of a is uh, pi by 4 and obviously this uh, point that is a pi by 4 uh, it belongs to uh, the interval that is 0 to uh, pi so here uh, we have the mod of sin theta and theta varies from 0 to pi and it implies that uh, we are in the uh, first and second quadrant right so here uh, we have the first quadrant this is second quadrant and theta varies from 0 to pi and we know that uh, when uh, we take uh, any value of theta lying uh, in the first and second quadrant then sin theta is uh, positive right so when theta uh, belongs to the interval 0 to pi then sin theta is positive so we can uh, write mod of sin theta is equal to positive sin theta uh, when uh, theta belongs to the interval 0 to pi right so f of theta now takes the form uh, theta sin theta so now we can write this integral i as uh, 0 to pi we have theta sin theta and delta double prime theta minus pi by 4 and d theta so uh, using this result uh, we have the value of this integral as minus 1 raised to n n is 2 here we write 2 and then Uh, we have f of second derivative so second derivative of f of theta at this point theta is equal to pi by 4 so here we write pi by 4 so minus 1 square is uh, plus 1 so we have f uh, second derivative of f at pi by 4 so now let us uh, differentiate f of theta so f prime of theta is uh, d by d theta of uh, theta sin theta and here uh, we can use the product rule for uh, differentiation so we have theta the derivative of sin theta is cos theta then we have sin theta 
and derivative of theta is 1 right so we have theta cos theta plus sine of theta now see uh, here we require the second derivative so second derivative uh, is obtained by differentiating uh, this function that is theta cos theta plus sine theta so now we can write uh, d by d theta of theta cos theta and the derivative of sine theta right so here uh, again uh, we'll apply the uh, product rule so first function then derivative of cosine uh, theta is minus sine theta and then we have cos theta and derivative of theta is 1 and the derivative of sine theta is the cos of theta so now we have here minus theta sine theta and then uh, cos theta plus cos theta is the two times cosine of uh, theta so the second derivative of f of theta is given by uh, this expression minus uh, theta sine theta plus 2 cos theta so now we have to evaluate uh, this uh, derivative at this point uh, theta is equal to pi by 4 so now taking theta is equal to pi by 4 we have minus pi by 4 sine uh, pi by 4 then we have 2 cos uh, pi by uh, 4 now sine pi by 4 is um, 1 over uh, square root of 2 so here we have 1 over square root of 2 and then we have 2 times a uh, 1 over square root of 2 now taking a uh, 1 over square root of 2 uh, common we have minus pi by 4 uh, plus 2 right so this expression can also be written as uh, minus pi plus 8 uh, 4 times 2 is 8 divided by 4 times square root of 2 right so the value of this integral is equal to uh, minus pi plus 8 uh, divided by uh, 4 times square root of 2